For anyone to get hep C, the blood of an infected person must get into the bloodstream of a non-infected person. We know that hepatitis C is only passed through blood to blood contact. This can include blood you can't see, blood that is microscopic, stuff you cannot see. Really tiny. Oh, dear me. Anytime there is blood present, you must treat all blood as if it's infected. Hep C is not an STI, which is sexual transmitted infection. To protect yourself, it's a good idea to always use a condom. Can't catch it from cuddling, kissing, sharing drinks, cigarettes. Let's see what else? Uh... Toilet seats. <laughs> People can share blood whenever they do anything together that can pierce the skin, like tattooing, piercing, and unsafe injecting. Most people get hepatitis C from reusing syringes and sharing equipment, such as spoons, water, swabs, uh, tourniquets, all that sort of stuff, even the filter. Small amounts of blood can stay on used injecting equipment. When shared, it can cause hep C. To avoid hep C, all equipments must be new. Every time, for every person. Fits, spoons, fresh water, tourniquet, swabs, filters. And always remember to wash your hands. To wash your hands properly, you have to sing happy birthday twice over. Wash them like this, and wash them like that. Get the little fingers in there. Move them around, wash the thumbs. Wash your wrists. All clean. This is true. Every time for every person. There is no way to tell that somebody has hepatitis C just by looking at them. Most people, if there's only one fit, they'll use the one fit that they've got. And so they go on thinking that if they use water or bleach to clean up the fit, that it will get rid of the blood that's in it. And you may not see the blood that's in it. The blood is still there. You put in yourself and the other person at risk. Someone who's very close to me has ended up with hepatitis C and it was because of one silly mistake. He went, he went with his mate to get a tattoo and his mate went first, he went second. When it was his turn, the tattooist did not change the inkwell or the needle. His mate has hepatitis C. 